in accordance with the teachings of our institutions, it is our duty, before entering upon any great or important undertaking, to invoke the aid and blessing of God. Let us, therefore, reverently unite with our chaplain in an address to the throne of grace. Great architect and you, ruler of the universe, we reverently invoke that blessing at this time. Grant us thine aid in our present undertaking that we all may do well, shall be done with an eye single to thy service and to the good of Freemasonry. May those who are now about to be invested with the government and conduct of this lodge be endued with wisdom to instruct their brethren in their duty, and which thou hast given in the great book of nature and revelation. May brotherly love, relief, and truth always prevail among the members of this lodge. May they be impressed with a comprehension of their duty to thee and to each other, that this lodge may be the means of lasting honor and glory. Amen. So will it be. Kindly repeat with me the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of our country. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I have the pleasure to introduce the flag escort. The officers of Bethel number 129, Job's daughters of San Jose, led us, um, led by Jamie Gallo, honored queen, Molly Anderson, Sienna Barney, Caitlin Semsak, Sophia Semsak, Zoe Overbelk, Dita Urzua, Sid Urzua, and uh, the Bethel Guardian is Jennifer Anderson, and her father is Doug Anderson, who Doug's been doing this for about 25 years. He is a past associate Grand Guardian. Thank you, ladies. Sir, the officers of this lodge lately.